Hello! Welcome back to Super Jerry 27's Nerd Cave of Comic Goodness. I've got some like insanely good news today with a recent recent CGC signature series submission. Wow, that's a freaking mouthful. But um, I sent in Uncanny X Men 266, which is the first appearance of Gambit, because I had two of them to be signed by Chris Claremont. And I sent in another book at about the same time, Green Lantern Corps 201, to be signed by Steve Englehart, that I got from the same person, Tom's Comics, on Facebook. And the the Green Lantern Corps came back at a 7.5, which I didn't foresee that at all. So it disappointed me. It even got me worried about my Uncanny X-Men. I even called CGC. I was like, hey, can I add pressing to this book after I sent it? They're like, no, you can't can't do that. It's, once it's done, it's done. God be with you, you know, whatever. I was like, oh, shit, this ain't going to come out good. I just I just was worried, worried, worried. So they finally updated and everything. Like, the Chris Claremont stuff went quick. And I realized why I got mine so fast. They generally, I think, ship them out by value, I think. So I finally got this puppy back, and it came back a 9.8. No pressing. Beautifully signed by Mr. Claremont. First appearance of Gambit. Um, yeah, uh, I did not expect a 9.8. Like, I remember when I first saw it on the website, because I, I can't stand to wait, and I'm like, I have to know, I have to know. Um, I saw 9.8, I almost lost it, and came perfect. The only thing new, they do something new. There's like a piece of plastic, like, holding the book in place, because remember I would tap them to make sure that the signature isn't sticking. So it's holding the book in place, so I can't move it around. Which is, I guess that's smart. I don't know. Maybe you'll be able to see. See? Yep. See that plastic right there? That's holding the book in place, I believe. I hope it's not an error, but I think it's all right. But yeah, so I'm thrilled. Hopefully Joe Rubenstein and Andy Kubert will do signings, and I'll get to sip this back out, and hopefully it'll maintain the 9.8. That's the worrisome thing. But I'm also worried about the signature being pulled off because it's a paint ink. If it was a Sharpie, I wouldn't care. So let me know in the comments, did you send anything to the Claremont signing? Uh, what did you get back? Have you ever experienced the signature coming off when they remove it? Let me know in the comments. Uh, like, subscribe, and I'll see you soon in another video. Bye.